Well, here are a couple of keys that I've made for a couple of customers. There's the top view, and there's the bottom view of another one. And uh, these keys are made out of C360 HO2 brass stock. Everything is machined in my shop, including the screws, the lock washers, the knob, the label. Uh, everything is done here in the shop. You cannot buy, or at least I couldn't find, those types of screws, so I decided to make my own. Um, this key does not use bearings. I wanted to keep it kind of the vintage classic style, so I have uh, pointed screws like the old J38 style keys that go into the beam there, and you can crank those down really hard and it still really has it doesn't bind the beam at all so it works very smoothly I have uh, replaced the spring with neodymium magnets and the adjustment here you unscrew that and increase the gap to decrease the tension the other magnet is hidden beneath the surface of the wood. So it keeps that out of sight and kind of adds a little mystery to it, I guess. It's overall, the overall length from the tip of the knob to the back is about nine and a half inches. It's three inches wide and the knob is two and a half inches or so from the table. And uh, the original one that I made, I didn't use the, I just put a shaft through the U-shape there for the, but it had a little side motion in it, and I didn't want that, so I fashioned up these screws with lock washers here. And it gives it kind of a vintage feel, kind of like the old G38 style. Because of the... Uh, size of it and also because of the magnet instead of the spring it's a very smooth key and it's quite easy to send high speed CW with a straight key. On the underside of it all the wiring paths are grooved all the contacts are uh, silver plated there's rubber feet on the bottom so uh, This is what it looks like. We'll kind of walk around them here. Although it looks the same on the other side. <laughs> Trying to think of something to give you a perspective on size. Here's a six inch sanding disc, maybe that'll help. Or five inch, I guess that is. So, the knobs are uh, made out of oak. I machined those on my lathe. The base is some kind of hardwood I had here in the shop. I don't know what kind it is, but it's really pretty, I think. I got about five coats of polyurethane on the base and the knob. So, it should last a while. I enjoy making them and I enjoy using them. And those who have used them say they really like them as well. So, k7su.com slash key to find out more.